Good morning from Ian and Iona. We're back on our parkrun tourism travels after Daddy's little excursion doing a marathon last week, didn't I? So sorry for a break in its normal service, but normal service is resumed. Where are we today, Iona? Have you completely forgotten? Yeah. Rushcliffe Parkrun, just near Nottingham. You didn't tell me when I woke up. Didn't I tell you when we woke up? It's a complete surprise because you didn't really know when you went to bed last night which parkrun we were doing this morning, did you? So, you, you can't blame me. I can't blame you. Sorry, it's all my fault. I only doesn't even know where she is at Parkrun today. But we're here coming to do a two lap course around Rushcliffe Park for Parkrun. So let's go find the start. Welcome to Rushcliffe. First time you're here today. I own that. We're off at Rushless Park Run. Chilly start. What have you seen though at the finish? I don't know that you think is a bit strange. <laughs> is it way too cold for ice cream? <laughs> More like hot chocolate from coffee weather, isn't it? Beautiful park here. So really looking forward to exploring it as we run round. to park before. There's a dog training centre here. A little a playground for dogs. So we're just doing one of the little mounds I think they describe them as. I think Tilly, just a little mound. My watch has just gone beef Iona. What does that mean? It's sweetie time. You've already got a blue tongue, does that mean you've already had a sweet? Yeah. I start one. Oh. More blue. <laughs> you've got a blue worm. Iona has just reminded me what the run director called these little mounds. They're blips. They're not hills, they're blips. So we're just running up a blip right now. To quote a Robert Frost poem, there's a path going two ways. And I chose the one actually more travelled on because I want to make sure I'm going the right way on part run so I'm following everybody else. But um, we could perhaps go later and explore the path less travelled on. So that was a 20 minute pace I just come through. Uh, I don't think we'll be trying to keep up with him. Um, he's on his second lap already. We're still on our first. Iona just doing her flying down the hill. And yes. You mean blip? Down the blip, sorry. And yes, that was somebody pushing a push chair just behind the 20 minute pacer. I can't even run it on my own that fast. We're just coming through the start. So we're all. Yeah. Almost halfway because you do a little bit extra on the second lap. As you can see on my left, there's a great playground here. So I'm looking forward to having a play on that later. And the coffee truck just by the start as well. We're just at the diversion point for the route. We're not turning right this time. We've got to go straight on to do another lap to enjoy this beautiful park all over again. There's some great places to explore in this park afterwards. So we're looking forward to sensory trails and insect trails. Looks like some musical instruments and so on in there, Iona. The lake by the start is lovely. Really beautiful. This 
It's time for another sweet. I feel like you know, I feel like you've done it for a long time but you just haven't done it. No, the lot watch literally just passed up. I'm not cheating you. What are you gonna have? Another blue one. <laughs> Your tongue will be bright blue. <laughs> <laughs> That's what I'm aiming for. Well, after the threat of snow on the way here, there's definitely a bit of snow landing on the car when we set off. Now it's a beautiful blue sky day. Iona is trying her galloping technique for parkrun. It's a new technique. I'm not sure whether we'll be at the Olympics soon. It makes you go quicker, does it, Iona? Will it be a new Olympic sport? Galloping? The 400 meter gallop at the Olympics. I like the sound of that. We're just back to the blitz on the course. So running up a blip and it gives you a lovely view out over the plains the side of us. We are wondering what the thing sticking up over there is. I will have to check that out and find out later. One of the other things in this park is model railways and railways. We will definitely go and explore those over the woods but you can see them just over on our left now. We're going down the blitz for the last time, so it's time for Iona to fly! We've got three miles ticked off, we're just about to go through where we started and then it's just a little bit further to go to get to the finish. is your tongue now? Blue. How's your playground rating, Iona? 585. You like this one, do you? Yeah, apart from that they closed off the climbing bit. The spider's web climbing? Yeah, it looks really fun, that, doesn't it? How's the slide? Really fast. And I banged myself on it. <laughs> I think it's a bit too fast. So this park run, there isn't a cafe at the park with seating down, which on a cold day like today, for breakfast you really want to sit inside. But there is somewhere I can get a coffee to enjoy while I own a phase on the playground. So I'm going to get myself a nice hot coffee to warm up. We're just heading into Ruddington now, see what we can find cafe-wise as we go over the railway. So we've got the Heritage Railway here, uh, and we'll probably explore that a bit as well. Well, I might have taken the family on a big loop but we have found somewhere for breakfast. We've come to the Heritage Centre, which is actually right by the start of Parkrun. I did take them on a bit of a circuit to get here, but they do do a good fry up by the looks of it. And we've got to see some steam engines on the way in. So I know we've enjoyed breakfast here at the Heritage Centre, haven't we? Yes. What do you rate this breakfast? Five out of five. It's a definite five out of five. Ewan said it was his best ever cafe just because they've got barbecue sauce available easily pleased. So now we're going to go and explore the Heritage Centre. There's loads to see here. There's model railways. Mummy's looking forward to going and exploring the Brickleback options and Iona's found what Iona? There's an ice spy on, but on the train. So that'd be great for our park run journeys on the trains, won't it? And there's also a Titanic. A model of the Titanic, yeah. Not a full-size one. That is a miniature model of the Titanic. So we'll go and explore the Heritage Centre together now. this park run you must come and visit the transport heritage center 
I think during the winter it can be closed, so do make sure perhaps you come certainly normally past Eater, but it's open today in February. Rowie ride, it's just a pound to ride on this lovely little proper steam engine. The smell of the steam and the coal is lovely. We're really enjoying ourselves. Great cafe, great place to explore, lots of things to see, great fun for the kids. Definitely highly recommended as a place to visit after your park run. Another thing you can enjoy after doing park run here is come and explore the sensory garden. Uh, we spotted it as we were running around the park run and it's great fun. Loads of things for the children to enjoy. So I only you and been really enjoying themselves here as well. So trains, sensory gardens, beautiful park. This is a fantastic park run to enjoy, especially if you've got children. I don't know, are you enjoying the sensory garden? Yeah, so what, it's fun. What do you rate this one as? Five out of five. Right now I'm doing this. So it wants you to get this person here to rest on each of these ledges. Our parkrun day is over, Iona. We're about to head home. Have you had fun? Yeah. It's a great park, isn't it, to come? Yeah. Loads of things to do, from trains to playgrounds to sensory parks, and a great park run as well. And, and a good breakfast. If you've got a dog, they've got a dog agility park. A dog agility, so you've got a playground for dogs. So if you've enjoyed today's adventure, then... Like, subscribe, put the notification bell and share and comment on them. Yeah, we'd love to hear as well. Is there things we're not saying about the park runs that you'd love to know about? Anything like that, do tell us. We'll see you on another park run adventure soon. Bye!